Hello everyone, James here from Lionco Realty. Just wanted to do another one of our weekly videos for you and today I just wanted to chat about the effects of positive immigration on our Wellington market. Now we've had a very, very buoyant market over the last sort of 16 to 18 months here in Wellington and there's a lot of media exposure about that that you've probably already seen. But one of the things that isn't talked about quite so much is the effect that positive immigration is having on our market here in Wellington. Over the last 12 months across New Zealand, we've had roughly about 67,000 new people immigrate to New Zealand. Now the vast majority of those are going into Auckland, but the figure of those people that are coming to Wellington City is actually 3,700 people. Now if you calculate that, when you're thinking about how many houses that we actually sell in Wellington City, we sell about 1,200 per annum. So if you can think, if you bring an extra 3,700 buyers into that market, it creates an extra lot of competition for every single house that wasn't there previously. So the key thing about these people coming to Wellington is that we've still got such a great place to live. A lot of these people are immigrating because they love the lifestyle here in Wellington. And the cool thing is that if you're coming from a much bigger city, the house prices still seem relatively low. So when you combine all of these people that are immigrating to Wellington because they love the lifestyle here with local buyers, that's still creating quite a bit of heat in the property market. Now it's hard to know what's going to happen over the next six months or a year because nobody can really predict the future. But I think as long as we retain this fact that we've got this good immigration coming in to Wellington, people choosing this as a great place to live, we'll keep those property prices going up in the short term. And my name's James and thanks very much for watching.